the only way I know how to tell the story of John Durham throughout my Highland career at Baylor is through four different artifacts that I have found that he has given to me over my time here at Baylor. My freshman year, getting to know John for the first time, going to Panera Bread with him for the very first few times, learning what it means to pray, learning what it means to give my life to the Lord through prayer. This book was given to me by him as a challenge to continue to mold and grow in a man of prayer. This was my first book um, when talking about prayer. That was the very first time that I had seen a man, a pastor of mine, that loved deeply to pray. As time went on at Highland, I went through sexual healing and counseling. I got this book, Unwanted, through Highland and through John's leadership in my life. He told me the stories of his life and how he healed through his own sexual healing when I was a sophomore and junior here at Baylor. Highland Soul Care. This is a personal journal of mine that John gave to me as a way to take notes throughout our times together and throughout each story that he told, that he, that he tells me. I don't know if you can see this. But more and more just notes taken from him um, in our time together. Uh, these, these notes are through the stories of him being a father, being a pastor, being a discipler, and even being a disciple. The notes that I've taken as I've learned from his life. Every time I interviewed John, he continued to tell me more and more things about his life. We got deeper. And as I grow in my relationship with Jesus, and as he grows in his relationship with Jesus, the expectation is that we continue to get deeper in our love of Jesus, which is leading me to this book, Deeper, by Dane Ortland. He gave me this book as a way to, to criminate, to finalize our time together. He wrote me a note in the middle of the page. It says, I thank God for your life, Mitch. Our lunches for the past four years have been a highlight for me. Panera equals Mitch. Love you, bro. John Durham, February 25th, 2024. That is the goal. That is the aim. When only telling a personal story of John, I think of him growing deeper in his faith with Jesus. As he pushes me to continue to grow deeper, every lunch I had, every question that I got to ask was always learning more in a deeper way about his life. Fatherhood, discipleship, being a pastor, counseling, prayer. That is the story of his discipleship through with me throughout college. Through every life phase, through every life challenge, I got to see John as he walked deeper with Jesus. Thank you.